Hello. Hope everybody's doing well tonight. Harvey says hi. Hey. He's excited because I just moved to the grass and there's water in it. He's like, it's my time. I need it. Not yet, bud. So I'm excited about this game. I'm also like grooving with this music. This is fun music <laughs> for the menu. What's also funny is that it loops for about 10 minutes and then it stops. <laughs> so I'm not sure why, but um, I've seen little bits and pieces of this game, but I haven't actually played it. Uh, and I don't know anything about the story. I've just, I just know what it looks like, really. I know that it's got dialogue choices and that kind of thing. But, um, aw, Harvey, I hope you settle down, bud. Hopefully Harvey will hang out with us. But, without further ado, let's start up a new game, shall we? Uh, the audio on this one was a little bit funny because... Uh, like, the menu is loud, but the rest of the game seems pretty quiet, so as always, let me know if anything's weird. If anything sounds poorly balanced. And I will fix it. Oh, my cords are all tangled. In the year Grandad died, we had the worst flood since 1998. The highway extension came. Oh. Oh, these are choices. Uh, we had the worst flood since 1998. Greg got trapped on the top of a doghouse. The power was out for two days. Casey Hartley came by in his dad's boat, and I laughed when I saw him. Granddad left me an apple crate of books. He loved ghost stories and quoted them to himself in the hospital bed. They went looking for the gods in their wings, in their trees. They feared death. Let's do in their wings, in their trees. All things die, be at peace. On his last day, he sat up suddenly and started and stared bug-eyed through the window uh, at the old playground at the old empty mill at the old parking lots at the old trains say at the old trains rattling to somewhere else from somewhere else he turned to my dad eyes still wide this house is haunted he said and died I'd say we're getting off on the right foot for Spooktober. Well, this is great. I mean, I didn't expect a party or anything, but I figured someone would be here. Welcome home, May. Ah, we have control. Must be such a relief to payphone companies that Possum Springs get zero cell reception. It'd be cool to call my parents, but some jerkhole took the time to actually rip it off. Who steals a phone? <laughs> wow, when did they put this up? Possum Springs has never looked more falsely advertised. We're starting off with quite, quite the sass. Harvey, you good? He's like, it's it's hard to tell, but the end of my mattress is right up against my chair. And he's like right on the edge of it. He's like practically leaning into my shoulder. Yeah. It's just funny when I look over and I see him like poking over the top of the chair. He's like, hey. Hey. Okay. Fiasco... Fox, you are too dreamy. I think that's... yeah. Welcome back to Gabra... What's in the news today, Malloy? 
Markets were up today. Way up. Looking at a chart and it's pretty impressive. The economy added 15,000 jobs. Mostly in the chart sector. Which is notoriously recession proof. Excuse me, but where is everybody? It's 1045, it's locked. Not a lot of folks getting off the last bus to Possum Springs these days. Just you. Isn't there supposed to be someone at the desk? Are you the janitor or something? Looks that way. What do you do? I fixed this door. Hey, Bridge. Welcome in. That's it? Nope. Can I squeeze past you? Nope. Just broke the damn thing. When do you think it might be done? Right after you go grab me a uh, Fias Cola from the machine. Am I paying for this? I always rig it when I'm here after hours. Nice. Free as in free? Free as in no one's here to say otherwise. Yeah, the, the bird does have a goatee. What the? They have a lime fiasco and he wants a Fisa Cola. That's just a waste. I guess Coke versus Pepsi. I hope I'm saying that right. That's, that's fine. Okay, just gotta grab it. One free Sakola. <laughs> Yummers. So what are you doing here? I live here. Well, lived here. Huh, strange. When do you think that door is going to be finished? Now. Goodbye. <laughs> Don't drink soda anymore, but back in the day, you were Team Coke. So, so was I. Yeah, I also stopped drinking soda. I, I like, uh, I remember when I just, what are you doing, Harvey? There's like a string that's like just out of reach. And so he was like looking at it and I'm like, don't do it. Don't do it. <laughs> don't go for it. Anyways, um, when I stopped drinking soda, I realized how much I was craving it. And I was like, oh, shit, this is actually addictive. <laughs> and so I just, like, never went back to it because I didn't want to actually, like, crave soda ever again. But uh, every now and again, I'll have, like, a Coke Zero, I guess. But I try to avoid it. Just as a personal preference. I don't knock anybody who drinks soda. Um, I'm not walking back out to the highway probably get hit by a car or something. Hey, where'd that janitor go? Did he walk? Well, I'm right outside town. Mom and dad, nowhere to be found. Dark and cold. Guess I'm walking. Alone. This bus station is maybe the newest thing in Possum Springs. Guess they got state funding or something? It makes a good first or last impression, I suppose. If not for the abandoned glass factory back there. Not getting rid of that anytime soon. Wow. I didn't realize how much I missed the sound of that train. I used to hear it in my bed at night. During the winter when the leaves were down. It's hard to tell when this character is being sarcastic or not because it seems like they're always sarcastic. Well, I guess I'm gonna hike through the woods. Through the woods is home. My bed. My negligent parents. Bridge, how is your day going? <laughs> yeah, I'm describing it. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to attack you. Ugh, oh, this is some dank nature. Dank nature and garbage. There used to be an old sawmill around here, I think. I mean, the park up there called Sawmill Park. 
looks like they lost uh, log at some point. Log load at some point. Gonna have to climb this, I guess. Aha! I like the art style of this a lot. Oh! Oh my god. That was dangerous! I could have died! That was amazing! <laughs> I'm not gonna die in this hole. Night's going well on the work lurk life? Hell yeah. We did it! We got out of the ditch. Wow, I haven't been here in maybe 10 years. And apparently no one else has. I don't know what they were going for here. Some sort of boat castle? Most of it's gone now. Just a thing for weird animals to eat and have babies in. Are you telling me we're gonna find some baby animals? Oh, come on. Don't think I have the upper body strength to climb this. You gotta use your legs. Eh. Can I jump up on any of these? Aha. Ahoy! Looks like the ladder's gone. If I could just get to the top of this thing. Ugh. I could never make it up onto that tree when I was a kid. The number of logs mocked me. The logs and the older kids. Let me see if I can visualize this. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Can't stop running while I do this, not even for a second. Gotta have enough momentum. I think I can do it. Run and jump, jump, jump. You're a cat, you can climb anything, right? Yeah, we're, we're a cat. This shouldn't be an issue. All right, well, I think I'm, the first thing I'm gonna do is ignore my own advice about the momentum thing. Yeah, I can just, I can, I can do it and pause. Heck yeah, we did it. It's only been two years since I lived here. Not in this playground, Possum Springs, I mean. This is all getting jumbled. I should write it down. R.I.P. Granda. Your parents forgot you. Oh. What happens if we go this way? Hey. Alright, we'll go back. How's the, uh, how's the background sound level bridge? Does it sound okay to you? Oof. <laughs> Hello, May. Been a while. Sick. Thank you, bridge. Uh, hey, what are you doing out here? Nothing better to do? I was out here doing my rounds and I saw you in a very off-limits playground. So, get in the car, May. No. You want to spend your first night back in jail, May? No. It's not our fault. They were supposed to pick us up and they didn't. Hey, remember me? Ah! May, you gave me a heart attack! Good! What are you doing? Oh. May, honey, we thought you were coming home tomorrow night. You thought wrong! How'd you get here? I walked until I got arrested by Aunt... Aunt Mall Cop. <laughs> Did you say hi to Molly for me? No! I say, I say hi for no one. 
F the cops. I'm going to bed. Is my bed still here? Or are we waiting for tomorrow night for that too? <laughs> ah, May. So good to hear that voice again. Good night. Busted on felony count of stealing soda. There are a few things hanging around here from the old country. This clock, the trunk in the storage room, and whatever is buried under the house after the cement incident. Can we go up more? What's up here? Oh, this is our room. Guess I should have checked the other room first. We did it! We survived day one! We- we did it. Could play some bass? But which song? Nah, later. Maybe. Wait, what was the other option there? Space dragon. Wanderer in space. No bad of forbidden place. Oh boy. Oh god, <laughs> this is hard. <laughs> When does this end? Oh, I was worried it was gonna repeat forever. I'm not a guitar hero person. <laughs> oh, it's still going, okay, okay. I know there's stuff going on the the side of the left side of the screen too, and I can't even focus on it because I'm just trying to not fuck up. What's also kind of crazy is that it doesn't. Uh... What's wild is that the response to the button presses is exact. So if you get the timing wrong, it it just is wrong. Oh, I'm sorry. I butchered that at the end there. Some of that I was okay, but oh, that's hard. That's not not my skill set. <laughs> Through the fire and flames, next! All right, next one, all right. Oh, let me stretch out my hands. Oh my God, I went climbing today and I like, I really worked hard climbing today and my forearms are like killing me. And then it was like doing all those button presses. I was like, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. <laughs> I like that, I like that though, it was cool. Uh, I literally do not know this song. <laughs> 
I wonder if you get it perfectly if he's like, yeah. Mm -hmm. Or she? May is the name, I think. I'll, I'll try that again if I get the opportunity, now that I know what to expect. I wasn't expecting that. What's in here? Gnarly riffs, bra. Nine, how are you doing? Ugh. Since when is the crawl space all jammed up? Wonder if dad could move them. Can't go in there yet. I was so cute then. We were all so cute then. Cuties, the lot of us. We could have traveling show the cute broskies. Can I go across here? Oh, I can. How is this bird still alive? That's a bad thing to say about a pet. <laughs> how is it still alive? Harvey, how are you still hanging in there, man? Orc, hello, welcome in. Orc, congratulations again. That's so exciting. It was pretty great when granddad gave me that apple crate of old scary stories. Not sure how they ended up out here. Death comes to Wigglesbury. The fancy corpse, Helmore Stevenson. Necrophus, Book of Book the First, Lady Shark, the Stagoat on Gallows Hill. I'm sure those are all references to real books that I just don't know. <laughs> Honey? Yeah? Come see me in the kitchen before you leave. Okay. You also forgot to pick us up. Hi, Mom. Welcome home, sweetie. Thanks for not changing the locks. Sorry we mixed up the day you were coming back. It was such short notice. It's okay, Mom. May, honey? Yeah? Is everything okay? What do you mean? Honey, did something happen? I just needed to come home. Well, sweetie, I think you can understand my worry. That's not usually something a college sophomore just up and does. I know. Honey, you can tell me if something happened. Mom, I'm fine, really. Can we talk about this another time? Sure, honey, it's okay. Thanks, Mom. I betcha your old friends will be happy to see you. You wouldn't happen to know where Greg is, would you? Oh, of course. Greg's working down at the Snack Falcon. Up in town center, west by Click Clank. We have a snack falcon now? Oh, yeah. It's so handy. You know, ever since the food donkey went out. The food donkey is gone? Oh, yeah. Gone almost a year now. Wow, where does everyone shop? Everyone goes out, uh, out to the Ham Panther out by the highway now. But I see your little friend Greg when I go into town. Wow, food donkey's gone. We have a snack falcon. It's a whole new world, sweetie. Yes, it is. Well, have a good time out there. Lots to explore. See what's changed. I will. Just watch out for all the construction. Well, it wouldn't be fall in Possum Springs without loads of construction. It's so festive, honey. I'll be back later. Bye, sweetie. Jem, hello. You loved this game. Oh, good to hear. Do you guys want to see Harvey? Ugh. Put that up so I can turn. There he is. Is my water bottle in the way? Look at him go. Give a cat a treat. Oh, he's gonna go fucking nuts. Hold up. Hold up. Let me full screen for you. Hey, Loof. You're just in time for cat cam. All right. We're gonna come over here. Sorry it mutes the game when I do that, but it's, it's 
That's how it goes. All right. Harvey, are you ready? Are you excited, bud? Another game about a mining town. Why are all games about mining towns? Excited? Look how excited he gets. Hey, hey bud. Will you come sit on my lap? You can have this if you come, come over on my lap a little bit. Come here. Come on. He just, he just doesn't want to come on my lap. Come on, bud. Just a little closer. <laughs> he refuses. He won't even put his feet on me. Aw, oh, bud. All right. Here you go. Look at him go. Harvey says thank you for the treats, as you can tell. Munch, 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 munch. I like that his little, ta his little tongue sticks out and grabbing it. Yeah. Luke, how are you doing today? How was the rest of your stream? One, one more good chunk, bud. Make it count. Yeah. Good boy. Good boy. Here he is, saying hi. What is it I'm feeding him? It's just grass. It's like cat grass, but it's not like catnip or anything. It's just regular old grass. Good boy. You're such a good boy. <laughs> He's going to try to jump up on my desk to get more. Uh, he fucking loves it. He adores cat grass. Um, goes crazy for it. He'll he'll like jump up on my desk when he's not allowed on my desk to try to get it and all all sorts of mischief. All sorts of cat mischief. All right, let's get this back. Here we go. I hope that was sufficient. I hope that was sufficient cat treats. Cat cam. I've got regular treats around here somewhere, too, that I'll give him next. Part one, home again. Which way am I supposed to go? Does it matter? Kill, kill, kill! What? Uh. It's a goat! Hey there, Mr. Twigmare. May? Is that you? Nope! Well, it looks like May. But it smells like May. I have a smell. When you were a kid, Susan used to call you a little dirt ball. I was never a dirt ball. Aw, May. You are our dirt ball. Every child's dream. See? Count your blessings. Well, you can count on seeing me around Mara. Feel free to rake my lawn. You paying? Get out of here, dirt ball. <laughs> this is cute. No casualties on the stream earlier? That's good. What's this? Ah! No, journal. Can I talk to you? Hello. What you doing on my porch? Hey, Mr. Mr. Chazvok. Chazvok. Chazovok. Chazovok. Hello, May. My best and worst student. Haha, <laughs> yeah. Like the constellations, hated school. Hey, don't knock school. School is vital for your future. What are you doing back in Possum Springs? I dropped out of school. Oh. Well, if you're still interested in constellations, come by my roof down the hill later this week. Should have my new telescope set up by then. Sure thing. That sounds cool. For a second I thought we were gonna get hit by the car.
Children. Look at the children. Hey, it's the Harleys. What are you doing? Little Joe, you're under arrest. Oh, wow. Kids still talk about Little Joe? We used your DNA. Ghosts don't have DNA. Yeah, ghosts don't have DNA. Hey, lady, can you leave us alone? Yeah, leave us alone, lady. Lady! <laughs> Danny, right? Yep. I think you were a senior when I was a freshman. Probably. How's it going? Just lost my job. Oh no. They say construction's always hiring, but it's not. In fact, it's often laying off guys named Dan. What are you gonna do? I'm open to suggestions. I'm sure someone in town is hiring. I've been out of work for a year before. And this time I only lasted six months before being laid off. Do you know what that does to a resume? Not really. I have a zombie resume. It's dead, but somehow it's still going all over the place. Oh. We'll just... We'll just leave. What a cool guy. I love telescopes. Right? Space is... Space is cool. Space is underrated. Town center platform, we can go in here. I love in like the middle of the summer on a clear night, just going out to a park, like try to get as far away from the city as you can and just stargaze. It's so nice. Like, especially when you get to see the Milky Way. I don't know, buddy. Space is pretty highly rated. <laughs> Alright, maybe stargazing is underrated. I, th I feel a lot of people like space. Not a lot of people will go out in the, in the middle of the night and, and look at stars. Unless you were making a pun, in which case... Hey, I just got back in town. Me? Pun? <laughs> and one thing I missed most was... Hey! I remember you! Hello! Thief! Oh, come on. That was years ago. Once a thief, always a thief. Alright, you know what? This isn't even a restaurant. It's a crappy food stand in a hole. This establishment has been in business for 50 years. 50 crappy years in a hole. You know what else has been in a hole for 50 years? Dead people from the 60s. No respect. No respect to this one. Keep your whole pretzels. And your damp... Prairie dogs? Is that... Pierogies. Pierogies. I, man, I got really mixed up on that one. Pierogies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go jump in the river. Oh, we can steal a pretzel. Ooh, it's tempting. It's always fun catching a shooting star or two. Yeah, yeah, there was, um... About a year ago, KY and I were up in New Hampshire and we went stargazing, and it was right at the end of a meteor shower. And so we saw a ton of shooting stars. It was so cool. It was it was like really just like magical. I'd never seen something like that before. It was really cool. Um actually have a telescope and hunting binoculars when the roof alarm was down and go up to the roof and watch the ancient Greek homies moving around. That's cool. I like that description also. Have I played Link's Awakening? I haven't, no. The only Zelda game I've played is Breath of the Wild, actually. I love catching a shooting star that turns out to be a UFO. <laughs> uh, meteor showers pretty regularly, like once every month or two. Really? What? That's so cool. We're totally gonna steal a pretzel, by the way. Delicious pretzels. How do I get one? Uh, can I 
Can I take one? There's a shop that you can steal from um, stuff from in Link's Awakening, but if the merchant catches you, he calls you a thief and kills you. <laughs> Am I crazy? Am I supposed to be able to take one? I guess not. Who are these guys? Hey, teens. Hey. What are you guys doing? Nothing. Cool. Cool that people still hang around down here. We used to do that when I was in high school. Yeah. Wasn't in high school that long ago, you know. How old are you? 20. Oh, so you can't buy beer. No. Do you have a car? No. Hmm. We're useless. I want to steal a pretzel. Wait, is that a real cat? Is that a, a real house cat and, and we're cats? Is this like people having pet monkeys? Like, monkeys are just hanging out? Miller's. It's almost five. Quitting time. Back some brews and watch the smelters. And nanny! <laughs> Snack Falcon. Well, here's where we're trying to get to. Look at the pigeons! Um, but yeah, that did remind me talking to, like, the teenagers in the underground area. I was at the climbing gym today, and I started talking to uh, some people who were about the same level as I was in, in, uh, of difficulty on the walls. And so we were workshopping how to how to do one of the routes, and we started chatting, um, and uh, they asked me what I went to school for, and I was like, oh, <laughs> oh, I I graduated a while ago. I take it you're in school, and and they um, yeah, they were like cur currently in college or you know something. And I was like, well, at least I passed. At least I passed for being, uh, you know, not 10 years older than you. <laughs> oh my god. Hey, Greg. What are you doing here? I'm back. I mean, I guess, like, wearing, like, a big mask and everything doesn't help. Or doesn't hurt. Like, back as in today? Back as in back. Too bad you didn't die at college. Too bad you didn't catch a flesh-eating disease. Too bad you didn't join a murder cult. Too bad you didn't lose all your limbs in a freak soda accident. God, it's good to see you. Ah! How's Angus? You two still a thing? Hold on. What are you doing? Changing the music. What? Angus? What are you doing here? I live here. Since when? Since last night? 11 or so? That's amazing. Come to band practice. Oh my god, the band is still a thing? Sure. When's practice? Now. When do you get off work? Now. Really? He's so excited. How nice. Freak soda accident. It does sound delicious. Oh. Oh, we're gonna we're gonna play bass again. Alright. Everyone buckle in. Hey Angus. Hey, it's you. 
It's May. It's May. So the party barn went out, huh? Yeah, not sure how it ever stayed open. Like, how many parties are there, really? You need a lot of parties to keep a barn running. I have your old base. Oh, dude. I don't think I even remember. Hey, Bay. Uh, May's back. Wow, hi. Yeah, hi. She's totally back! Wait, what? Are you, uh, here for band practice? I play drums. That's not drums. That's computer. Fine, she also does your bass part. Well, I understood them as the bass parts. But I can turn them off. Turn them off? On your computer? May... May, we're totally gonna play a song. You totally have to play bass. I don't even remember. Those aren't drums. <laughs> this seems so awkward. Yeah. Oh boy. All right. Okay. Oh, that earlier one was warm up. <laughs> so well. <sighs> I wish I could read the lyrics, but... my hands <laughs> you guys I picked the wrong day to go climbing <laughs> I could beat most songs on hard with a controller and guitar hero but expert was way too fast oh man I watched people play rock band and stuff in high school but I I never partook pretty good yeah that was okay not bad considering I don't know this song holy crap that was hard to do. Yeah, we'll get back in practice. I hope. Jeez. My wrist hurts. That was great, man. Just, uh, like, just seeing you back. Playing your old horrible bass. Okay, are we doing this diner thing? Yeah! Woo! Yay. Hip. Hip. You won the local Guitar Hero tournament back in the day. Oh man, we've got we've got we've got a pro in here. Hell yeah, did you miss pizza, May? They have pizza at school. Oh, cool. And now you've carpal tunnel. Oh no. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. See, that's what I was trying to do to steal the pretzel, but it wouldn't let me. Pizza isn't great. It's pretty horrible. 
Dudes, haven't you heard of the pizza scale? Screw it. Pizza good. That's basically the pizza scale. He's explained it to me several times. That's about it. Pizza good. I mean, it's no possibilities. Mm, I missed possibilities. I'm not touching those crusts. Same. We should have gone to possibilities. The diner has ambience. The seats are comfy. The food is terrible, but it's got charm. You too fancy for the diner now? Guys, please. I was raised in this diner. You and like a zillion rats. Guitar Hero Legend. Yeah. So when are we gonna play out? May. We don't play out. Oh. We have jobs, May. I work at the Video Outpost. Uh, Video Outpost 2. I'm at the old pickaxe. I thought you were going to school. Huh. Yeah, well, life happens. I'm Lord of the Snack Falcons. I like that he's hitting the... <laughs> Where's Cassie? Oh, yeah. You wouldn't know, huh? Cassie's gone. Gone? Gone how? Popped a train, I bet. Oh, wow. He always talked about doing that. Yeah, just one day he was just gone. He made a clean break, have an email or anything. Well, good for him, I guess. His parents put up missing person posters, but everyone knew what happened. Jeez, Casey, uh... Mm-hmm. And what exactly do you do, May? I was in college? And why exactly are you not still there? The little fox is so hype. Yeah, he's so cute. The leather jacket is clean, not gonna lie. Yeah. I've always kind of wanted, like, a good leather jacket, you know? I've never had one, but I don't really want to get an expensive jacket. Maybe one day. Maybe someday. Maybe I'll, like, I'll find a good one at a thrift store. Didn't work out. Huh, imagine that. Rude. Okay. Whoa, we better get home, dude. Yeah, Angus got a date with sword people online. Aw, oh, lucky! It's really great to be back. Dude, we can hang out every day! Oh my god. Holy crap. Yeah, sword people online, is that like... What game is that referencing? What, is that an arm? That's an arm. Nobody move. Let's poke it with a stick. I call first. Wait, there's an arm on the ground. What? May, this is like tampering with evidence. Uh, I'm gonna have to start worrying about getting dismembered on my way home. Shh, I want to watch this. You don't need your ears to watch. Sword art online? Mmm. Gotcha. Bridge is an anime expert now. Just a joke about general online sword games. That was kind of like my guess, but it, I wouldn't be surprised if Sword Art Online, if it's actually something specific. Um, shush. Uh. Is that a cockroach? I think we've sufficiently poked it. Now, what's going on here? Uh-oh. I 
tried to poke the roach, but anytime I went near it, it went under the arm. And I just had bad luck. Hey, Aunt Molly, we found an arm. All right, May, put the stick down, step away from the arm. All right, all right, don't taser me or anything. No promises. Oh, well, I think it's time for Angus and I to get home. We'll see you tomorrow, May. All right, I don't want any of you walking home alone tonight. Buddy system, something bad's going on. I can drive home, uh, May home, officer. Thank you, Bay. Yeah, thanks, Bay. Let's roll. Is this just a morbid cookie clicker? It might be. So, working at the old pickaxe. Yep. Are they training you to take over the family business? They? Uh, your parents? Hey, look, we're here. Oh, my house isn't actually for a few blocks. Get out. Okay. Thanks for the ride. Go. <laughs> wow, alright. Get lost. Eyes on the road, Jesus. <laughs> I was thinking that. I'm like, huh. I was, maybe because it's a crocodile, the eyes are on the side? Hey, kitten. Roar. Listen, May, I'm sorry about last night. I really thought you were coming home tonight. It's okay. Went through the ravine by the old mill. Almost died. What? Yeah, logs almost killed me. Normal stuff. Well, I promise you'll never, uh, I'll never leave you stranded again. Tell you what. How about we pretend I did come home tonight, and we just go back to the, from the bus station? Start over? Yeah. Okay. Hey, Dad. Hey, May. Thanks for picking me up. Welcome home, May. I'm gonna go to sleep, I think. Well, you had a big day. Good night, kitten. <laughs> Alright. Love May, she's so good. Yeah, I like her attitude. She's very sassy. I'm into it. Bedtime? Yeah. Let's do it. Go sleep. Day two. Day three, I guess, technically? We had two sleeps. Oh, I'm so thirsty. Man. Wow, it's been literally 36 hours since I've been online. This shall not stand. Oh, no. What's wrong with you? Damn it. I bet Angus knows how to fix this. He's all computery, I think. But I can't let him see this. Where does he work again? <laughs> Yikes. Okay, okay. Curious. For, for all y'all in chat. If you are gonna run some errands, go to the store, get groceries, what have you. Something routine, something that you're very familiar with doing that you've done a lot. Can you, or like would you, ever do it without your phone? Would you leave your phone at home? I'm curious. I'm curious. Oh, that's just going back into the phone. We don't need this. We don't need this. Oh, that's- oh, that's the laptop. Oh, I didn't even see it on the bed there. Can't go in that room. Are the prompts here the same? This thing goes off randomly every month or so. Little wooden duck pops out, makes the weirdest sound, scares dad half to death every time. Used to joke it was the granddad getting even with him from beyond the grave.
You do, it's kind of awkward though. Okay, we can't get through there yet. Mostly leave your phone at home when you leave the house unless you want music. Wow. That's so rare these days. Like, I mean, I, I'll definitely use music. That'll be like my primary reason for having my phone with me. But if I don't have my phone with me, pretty much at any time, I get anxiety. Even just like going into the next room to watch a movie, if I leave my, my phone in my bedroom, I am thinking about not having it. Hey, hon. Yeah? Come say hi. You would lose your mo uh, you lose your mind if you weren't near your phone. See, I I I get that, and I have like realized that uh, that I don't know. Maybe I should intentionally go places without my phone sometimes. Live here literally the opposite on the side of not needing your phone. I assume that's why you have uh, have the relationship with phones that you do. I assume it's a much more healthy one, Nine, than mine. <laughs> Drop your phone in the pantry when you come home and pick it up on the way out the door the next morning. Oh my god. Really? Man, I'll be like, I'll be, it's, I'll, I'll be honest. It's a struggle for me not to check my phone when I'm streaming. Like, I'll be sitting here, my phone will be here, and it'll light up, and I'll be like, is it important? It's never important. And it's, like, never going to be important, right? There's nothing that'll ever come on my phone that needs attention within the next ten minutes, right? But I'm still just like, who is it, though? <laughs> You're paranoid you never trusted smartphones. Mm, okay. Turns out I was right to be paranoid about them. Yeah, there's, I mean, it's, it's definitely, there are negatives to how uh, technology is so ingrained in our lives, and it definitely, you know learns uh learns things about our behavior to better improve things like marketing or, or what have you that is um uh that is still st that is a thing you'll get emergency emergency calls from time to time yeah yeah that's also true if you know you have like family or people close to you that have certain medical conditions or or, or something you want to be more available to your phone for that, for sure. Morning, Mom. Nope, I'm Mom 24 hours a day. Har, har, har. Um, uh, also, it's 4 p.m., sweetie. Well, I'm off to find Angus. Oh, uh, is he your little friend Greg's boyfriend? Big guy? Kinda quiet? Yeah, that's him. I need him to fix my laptop. Well, he better, sweetie. You can't afford to buy a new one. Wait, how do you know- do you even know Angus? Do you? Mom, we are in a band together, sorta. Oh, is the band back together? Yeah, we practiced last night. I don't think we're ever gonna play, though. Hmm. Well, that sounds like fun, honey. Yeah, I guess so. You don't sound too happy about it. Eh, well, I'm off to find Angus. Have a good time, daughter. Thanks, 24-hour mom. Seven days a week. I uh, definitely felt that when you leave the phone at home for an errand, you're always scared you'll come back to a bunch of missed calls from your mom and something bad happened. It's funny, as kids we all complained about commercials interrupting our shows as kids, now we help them advertise to us more and better. Yeah, no kidding, no kidding, Loof. Um, and then, Jem, going back to your comment, what's what's weird to me is that if I leave my phone at home, I don't even worry about, like, getting an emergency call. That's never, like, on my mind when I have anxiety about not having my phone. I just, like... It's hard to explain, and I know that there are studies that have explained it better than I can. Um... It's like, it's like just being used to having everything you could possibly need at your fingertips at any moment in time. Yeah, maybe FOMO. That, yeah, FOMO sounds, um, pretty on par. Hey, you kid. Adult. So you're back, huh? Yes, Mr. Penderson. Didn't last long, huh? No, Mr. Penderson. You get a job yet? Yes, I've been elected mayor. Huh. Couldn't do worse than the current one. And I've ordered your house to be bulldozed. 
What, finishing the job you started? I hope you enjoy living in the woods. Those eggs took the paint off the vinyl siding. Scavenge food. Commune with the beasts, Mr. Penderson. Watch yourself, little miss. Little effing miss. No one's forgotten who you are and what you did, you know. They may act like you have, but this is just a small, polite... Uh, just a small town, polite... Right there. Um, small town, polite, right there. There we go. Is that what this is? Small town's polite's all you got, kid. So watch it. Well, that was really interesting. I they need to go listen to my cells die. Huh. Huh. Well, it sure is fall. All the road work crammed in before winter. Makes like half the town inaccessible. Unless you want to walk the long way around for like 20 minutes, which I mean, no. Alright, we can't go this way. Lurk for a bit, you'll be back. Jem, have a great lurk. Thanks for stopping by. Always great to see ya. Used to be awful with Facebook, but I'm way happier now that I check it once every three months. Yeah, I, I've been slowly disconnecting from Facebook. Um, I used to be on it several times a day, actively scrolling. I now check it once a day, at most. Sometimes I'll go a couple of days without checking it. But it's like, I don't post anymore, I don't comment on anything, like, I just open it up. And every time I do, I'm like, why am I getting notifications about things and people that I don't, like, interact with at all? Uh, so that's helping me stay out of it. The only thing that I'll use Facebook for these days are local groups. Like, there's a lot of buy nothing groups or yard sale groups. And sometimes I'll, I'll post things there that I'm getting rid of or want to buy or, or whatever. Lurk, uh, nine. Same to you. Thanks for that lurk. Um, have a good one if I don't see ya. Ugh. Selmers! What are you doing home? Dropped out. Wow. Yeah, I guess. So, like, you just don't go back? That's about it. Weird. So how have you been? Okay. Me and Dennis split. Oh no. Yeah, he got a job at the new prison over in Brittle, and he met some girl at a gas station. Wow, what a jerk. Eh, he's a free agent, I guess. Is this the porch guy? This is my property. But it's my street. You ain't changed since you was a kid. Just seeing people post the best days of their life non-stop generates fake FOMO. It makes you think everyone is having more fun than you, when in reality it's just that no one posts about their boring average days. That is absolutely true. Um, I remember I saw, I, th I think it was an, it was some sort of ad or like a short film or something, um, but it was like someone waking up and like, really in like a bad mood they go online and they like see all this stuff online and so they, they get dressed in their like workout gear and they drive out to the park and they get out and they take a selfie and it's like going for a run and then they immediately get back in their car and drive home <laughs> it's like man I wonder how many people do that missing Casey Hartley of Possum Springs last seen at dusk on June 27th walking westward along the tracks behind former food donkey he was wearing a black hooded sweatshirt jeans and canvas shoes if you have any information as to his location at any time since his last known sighting please contact Possum Springs Police Department immediately oh I can't take it I can like move it around but I can't take it Huh. 
what's that say? Has never lost a child? What? It's weird that I can move these around, but I can't do anything with it. I guess I could, like, cover it, but that seems fucked up. I kind of want to go back in here just to, uh, see if I can steal pretzel now. For you. Pale white tunnel fish. Easy to catch and so delish. That's good. Oh god, you were listening. Sorry, man, didn't mean to make you self-conscious. Oh, hello, May. Um, do I know you? I don't know if you remember me, Miss Rosa? Hmm. I knew your grandfather. I visited you the day after you were born. You were so small. I guess some things change, huh? How did you know Granddad? I'm here most days. Why don't you stop by sometime? I'll tell you all about him. Things you might not know. Alright, you've got my interest. Sweet, curious child. Alright, I still can't get the pretzels. Um, we, we didn't go the other way before where we just skipped past this. So I kind of I kind of want to see what happens if we go straight. Bird. Market house. The old pickaxe. Hey killer. Uh, don't call me that. Who are you? Lori. How do you even know about the killer thing? That was a big deal, even to us middle schoolers. And what did the middle schoolers say? You put him in the hospital, and no one knows why. Did he, like, have it coming or something? No. Our mothers told us not to talk to you, because no one knew when you were gonna do it again. Well, say hi to your mom for me. She sounds lovely. Oh, she's gone. Oh, I'm sorry. It's fine. Yeesh. Alright, we'll just nope on out of there. I think I have a great great uncle or something on this. Yep, there you go. Uh, Anselm Broski. Anselm? Even in life, he was tragic. <laughs> This is cute. This is cute. I like this. The, the like, almost paper cutout style animation um, is pretty fun. Two? Is that, like, two? Or, like, also? This is an error so bad, even I wouldn't make it. Can I help you? I don't think so. Maybe this isn't where we're supposed to go. Where does he work? I thought he worked at the video store. Dave, hello! How's it going? Pretty good. This game's cute as heck. Better take shelter. Here come the smelters. No use hiding, smelters. We'll find you. Oh, can I go up? Can I go in? The can I go in? Nope. We can go back into the snack falcon. Oh, no, no, no! I hit the wrong button! Fuck! Back in we go. Why do you have cups on your head? Hey, May. Got cups on my ears. Why? I was thinking about how they have beaches in Bright Harbor. And then I was thinking about the ocean. And then I put cups on my ears. And it sounds like the ocean. Wow, dude, you took on me on a journey. Speaking of, uh, n nothing I get. You know where I could find Angus? At work, at the video store. What do you want Angus for? That's where we just were. We were just at the video store. Got computer problems. Figured he might know a thing or two. He's a hacker. Really? I'm pretty sure he hacks. Wow. Cool dude. I'll catch you later. Definitely. I'm so glad you're back. I love him. He's my favorite. saw garlic play a bit of this and yeah it seems like a good time yeah that's how i found out about it was i saw garlic playing it 
and uh, and was interested in in picking it up. And then it was coincidentally in um, one of the itch.io bundles, and so I was like, oh, I already own it. I don't even have to buy it. Can you tell us where he is? Can I help you? Where's Angus? Oh, he works day shift? Is it day? He got- I got here early? Any idea where he is? I assume he went home. He lives next door. Go inside and ring the buzzer? Wait, why does everything you say sound like a question? Uh, you do the same thing? I just didn't comment on it? Really? Yeah? Huh. Night shift, huh? That's cool. I'm at home with my baby during the day. Until my mom gets back from work. Ew, babies. Pretty cool job, though. I get to watch movies, eat candy, meet cute guys. Ew, cute guys. What's wrong with guys? I don't know. Cute guys are overrated. works next door. There's no houses that way, so it's probably this one. Maybe this one? Oh, we just go straight in. Buzzer. Greg and Angus. What? There's no button? Huh, there's gotta be some way to make this work. Click! Mm, yes? Uh, hi, Angus. Angus, you say? Dude, it's May. Tell me about yourself, Maybelline. This isn't Angus. Would you like it to be? Nope. Bye. Weird. All right. Maurice? May. Angus? May? Yeah. You're not Angus. And you aren't Maurice. Well, I'm glad we sorted that out. Hello, Angus? Are you searching, my child? Yeah. For Angus. You can search all you like for Angus. Everyone has a different Angus. For some, Angus is a happy marriage. For some, a good career. For some, a fancy car. Angus is a guy named Angus. Lives here. My child, no one, no Angus will ever co uh, compare to the one true Angus. The Lord God above. Okay. Dear, have you encountered God this day? Look, my mom works at a church. I'm in the club by default. Uh, I guess we'll do this bottom one first. Hello? 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 I'm looking for Angus. Any idea where Angus lives? I believe he's at number two. Written on the button, I think. It looks, uh, broken. I think the little guy he lives with kicked it in. Greg? Or something. How? Beats me, kid. I just live here. Hello? Hello? You're not Angus. Who is this? Who are you? May Broski. What are you selling? Do you get a lot of people selling you stuff? Hello? Hey, Brooks. How you doing? Alright, so he's in unit two. Can we just go upstairs and just knock on his doorbell? shit. Hello? Ah! Who is this? Hi, it's May. May? Yeah, May. I just got electrocuted. Oh, yeah, it's fiddly. There's no button! Yeah, you can, like, stick a screwdriver in and, well, it's too late now. Uh, come on up. Well, alright. Aggressive. Yay! 
Yeah, no, totally safe. Whoa, come right in. Hey, dude. Uh, welcome to our apartment. It could have been in my underwear. Hey, dude, don't wear pants on my account. Why was the door unlocked? Greg always forgets to lock it. Greg's at work if you're looking for Greg. I was actually looking for you. My laptop is messed up and I thought, what's wrong with it? It's a lot of pop-up things when I turn it on. What kind of things? Oh, you know, things about things. Not for kids, I guess. Why didn't you bring it with you? I forgot it. Hmm. You know, May, don't have to be embarrassed about... I'm not. I mean, everyone... I know. Uh, let me see what I can do. Okay, I got something for you. Plug this into any USB port and restart. Should clear it right up. It might delete some of your old files, though. Wow, thanks, dude. No problem. Gonna head on home. See if your magic works. It's not magic. It's just uh, ones and zeros. And we're just atoms. And our perception of reality is just chemical reactions. Take those away, and poof. There goes the universe. Whoa. Sorry. I'm gonna go. <laughs> on that note, I'm leading. Hey, Dadders. What if it isn't the mayor of Possum Springs herself? What did you get up to today? Hung out with Angus a bit. Do you remember him? Oh yeah, I like Angus. He's smart. In the old days, I used to work with his dad. I know they uh, fell on some hard times after we all got laid off. Used to see him at the bar. Yeah. After I stopped drinking, I didn't really see him as much. I wonder how he is. Yeah, Dadders. <laughs> I love it. All right. We'll keep going up. That's also reminded me something. There was something I wanted to show you guys. As it's funny, but I want to double check that it's not like... Yeah. I'll just cover up their names. So, um, when I was leaving the house today, I found a, a note to uh, from our neighbors, like in a little envelope um that was like super cute just like left on our doormat and um when i opened it up i'll hold it up it's like this really cute little note and i'll read it but it's got a little drawing there um and it says dearest neighbors our sincerest apologies for last night's ruckus there was a very large bug it took three of us a vacuum and a broom to battle it Thankfully, we won. Sorry for the screams. Signed, your downstairs neighbors. And then it lists their names. And Chunky the cat, who did nothing to help. Here's a visual description of how big the bug was. And then, it's, and then it says, evil, but this was, uh, but ten times bigger than the bug that's drawn. <laughs> I was like, that's so cute. <laughs> I messaged them. Uh, it was, it was like, we didn't even notice. It's all good. I had no idea. Yeah, at least they let us know. Yeah, they're really sweet. They just moved in like a month ago. Let's see if this Angus fix works. Can't get any worse, at least. I guess it could be on fire? Anyway. Oh, yeah. So I'm curious. Are are any of you all planning to, like, dress up for Halloween this year? For those of you who celebrate said, said holiday? I know not... Everybody outside of the U.S. celebrates Halloween, um, but with COVID and Delta and all that, like, people are doing fewer, like, Halloween parties. I know last year I didn't really dress up, so I'm like, maybe this year. Maybe this year I have a reason to dress up, put on a costume for Halloween on Twitch, but otherwise. Oh my god, it's fixed! I guess it turned out okay then. Your computer? Yeah, it did. Thanks. I put something else on that drive. Do you remember Demon Tower? Oh, wow. I used to play that all the time like 10 years ago. I've been playing it again. They've kept updating it. You can grab your old save game from their server and start right where you left off. 
Oh, cool. You should check it out and we can talk Demon Tower sometime. It's really cool still. I'm deaf doing this. Thanks, Angus. Tips hat. <laughs> hey, if you get that, uh, did you get that porn off your laptop? I heard you broke it with so much porn. Dude, you know it. Rick Wreckage told me before the internet they'd hide porn in a hollow log in the woods. Yeah, that was a thing, right? Be awkward if you were hiking out to the porn and some dude was already there. Like, sup, dude? I guess we're both here for the porn. Yeah, that happened. You know it did. I bet they became friends. Porn log bros forever. So, dude, you coming to the party tomorrow night? What party? Up in the state forest. Lots of people home from school and stuff this weekend. Cool people. The big fire, the stacks, the beers. Did you mean to write snacks or snakes? Did <laughs> I didn't even notice. Girl, you know I will. Girl, I'm so excited. Woods are so fun at night. I'm gonna get so wasted. There are no laws in the woods. Cool, well, you should ask Bay if she can drive us. Oh, uh, what? No, I don't think she likes me. Nah, dude, she's cool. She drives all, uh, drives us all the time and lets us borrow her car. Stop by the store tomorrow and ask, please. All right, whatever. Yay! Oh, look at that. We got a, we got a, a pizza mouse. Um. Might be for a stream, but... It, just maybe so far. Gotcha. Yeah, I, I feel like I'll do, like, some sort of, like, makeup thing and then maybe wear, like, a related outfit. <laughs> Is this, like, a horror game? I, I, I'd I say it's a, a Halloween spooky-themed game. I think it gets spookier, but I don't think it's a horror game. Um, but I haven't played it, so I'm not sure. So far, nothing has been spooky or whatever. It's just, but it's been, like, fall-themed. Let's play Demon Tower. In the age of blood, a pale one will rise, wielding naught but a simple blade who dares to climb the steps of... Ancient Dome Spire, Demon Tower. Part 4, Slaughter of the Blood Thief. Night in the Woods sounds like a bad idea. Are you not one for camping, Brooks? <laughs> so... Oh, it's Hollow Knight. We're playing Hollow Knight now. Halloween-themed Hollow Knight. I'm here for it. Um, PRG tried to raid and it didn't work. Oh, that was thunder in the game. I thought that that was like something at my window. Is that health? Hell yeah. You raided the wrong ray! <laughs> Whoopsie daisies. Well, I appreciate the thought. <laughs> Cyan God, thanks for the follow. What a good name. What's up? Not much. How you doing? Uh, surrender to the horror? No. No, no, no. We're still playing. I was just pausing for a minute. Yeah, if uh if PRG makes his way over to the to the correct array stream, we'll give him a shout out. <laughs> or 
Mark, what you doing? You you know mod. What's this? We're late to the party because PRG dropped us somewhere out of nowhere. <laughs> I had to walk all the way back, but it's good now. Well, I'm glad you made it. Welcome in. PRG, thank you for the almost raid. <laughs> Oh, we're full up on health. We're doing so good. Ah, ah, what? Ugh. It's too fast. Oh, you good, Dave. Thanks for getting the shout out. Excellent, excellent. This is cute, but where are we going? Can we go this way? <gasps> we can. Ugh, I'm so bad. Here we go. PRG, welcome in. Sorry, Bachelorette. It's okay, man. I appreciate the thought. Yeah, thought that counts. Thought that counts. We got a key. All right, so maybe we can go back up to uh, that door now. I kind of want to go this way because I know that there was more health. Yeah, we left a bunch of health over here. Door. Heck yeah. You do PR and marketing for orc? Hell yeah. And maybe in real life too, but especially orc. Oh, we got a boss, we got a boss, we got a boss. orc to gone That wasn't much of a boss, but okay. <laughs> Please tell him about the orc to gone I'm here. I'm ready. Oh, that was dark. This is very cute. comes to your mind when you hear the word orctagon. I mean, I guess octagon, but then with orcs. So maybe like maybe a bunch of orcs standing around in the shape of an octagon. can't dash across that all right I guess we can't go this way oh, I'm telling you it's gonna dude it's gonna work I'm very now I'm very curious getting very curious so I can't go across here either oh I can okay so there I can it was just the other Maybe I just timed it wrong. Well, it's all right. We'll explore this area first. Oh God, that almost killed me, jeez. Oh, 
Oh, that's gonna be your tournament series. Okay. like this. This is really cute. Um, like, this actually plays okay. Um, this just, like, random dungeon diver in the middle of this other game. The best of the beasts! Gonna be Orcs Tournament Series. That's amazing. Did we get a key? We did get a key. Okay, cool. We can progress. Get out of here! All right, let's see if we can get across here. Yeah, all right, so we have to dash a little bit earlier than I anticipate to get across that. There we go. I want to get really far. I don't want to... I don't want to die. Uh, I just noticed that there's like little arrows on the ground. Oh, I don't I guess that doesn't Apply to anything Stay tuned for more and follow orc I'll be there level this is. Almost got him. Yeah. Did it. Didn't beef it. Hell yeah. That bird was trying to hit you the Sack filled with soap bars. <laughs> Pretty sure everyone in here already follows you. Yeah, that's that's probably a safe bet, Orc. Our communities are pretty intertwined. I've got a permanent damaged health there. Oh, that's cool. I can dash through enemies. I didn't realize that. Orc already famous. <laughs> and they asked me if I wanted to be famous and I clicked the link. <laughs> Yeah, imagine what happens if you don't ban them. Like, make them mods. Ugh. Every bot you said got you. <laughs> Loops like I'm ready to go. Let's let's do some disasters in this chat. It's 
ominous sound. Alright, we've been here. We'll keep going up. So PRG, how was your stream? I'm sorry, I got so distracted there. I've been very distracted by this game also. I'm just trying to keep up with chat. I haven't been asking y'all how you're doing. Did you have a good stream? What were you playing? We got it, we got our key. We're good to progress. I feel like I just came back to chaos. <laughs> like that one one gift from community. Mm. He won a tournament. Wait, what were you playing though? It was orc centric, god damn it. <laughs> Orcs taking over everybody's streams today, huh? But that's okay, because we love him. Played Link's Awakening. Nice. Alright, boss number three, let's go! <laughs> it's not my fault, Cyan's been hyping you up. Well deserved. I mean, you've had a good day. Oh god, okay. This is annoying. Fuck. I really want to just fight the, uh, hit the boss here. Ooh, this might, this might be the end of me. There's a health there. <laughs> They're just covering the floor. Fuck. Fuck, fuck. Only one left. Do we get to try again? I'll try it again. I'll try it again. I'm having fun with this. I'm, I don't want to quit the game yet. No dash attack? Sort of. There's like a charge. So you can like dash and then attack really quickly. You can dash through them, but the timing is weird. I'm just not used to it. Miss these simple and chill games. Yeah, like they, there's like, there's something good about a simple game that you really just like know what to expect it doesn't have to reinvent the wheel to be fun um. oh new world i've seen a bunch of people playing that how has it been like it seems like people are really enjoying it
You know what I'm realizing is I probably actually don't have to fight all these guys. I can, now that I, I know where the thing is, which I think was over this way. I can probably just... Oof. Ugh. See, like, that's actually a little bit hard to do, because you have to dash. Oh, God. Like, there, yeah. Fuck! Well, that was a net zero. Come at me. Man, where was it? Oh. One of these might have something. Nope. A lot of people are talking about it. Didn't think you'd be into it, but the PvP stuff is actually deeper than you thought. Nice. Been playing competitive games for so long that I forgot how it is to play these chill games. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Totally. They can be fun. I'm always more of a, a single player game. Like, it's gonna be pretty rare on my channel that I play a multiplayer game. The one exception I think is gonna be uh, Back for Blood. I think I'm gonna be playing Back for Blood a fair amount. Find a balance in sweat and chill. <laughs> I think that most of my games, most of the games I play are either for re relaxation or story. Um, I don't know. And then FTL is somewhere in there. I don't think FTL is relaxing, but I play that. I just started playing that off stream and it's like, kind of addicting. PRG heading off to watch some TV. Have a good night. PRG, thank you so much for the the uh, attempted raid. I really appreciate the thought. I know it didn't it didn't work out, uh, but still very much appreciate it. Um, wait, did Bridge Lee, was Bridge taken off too? Uh. Did I miss something? Oh, that's been everyone saying goodbye to Bridge. <laughs> I was like, I can see Bridge. <laughs> Can't read name because it's uh, super red on your screen. Yeah, it's funny when when people have like the same colors, I get them mixed up all the time. I I did switch. Um, I had to switch my settings in uh, Better Twitch TV to have it be like legible colors, so everything is just like a little bit easier to read. But yeah, take it easy, PRG. Thank you again. Appreciate you bringing your community over here. All right, can I get this without taking damage? All right, now we just have to leave. Ugh. All right, we did it, we did it, we did it, we did it. All right, let's go fight the boss. We don't need to clear out the rest of the rooms or anything. I guess we have to clear out this one. Oh, damn it. All right. At least we got a health back. All right. I just want to like spam hit this guy there we go oh cool perfect i was just taking too long before i was like being too cautious i just had to just get him heck yeah we did it we did it i'm glad that it didn't make us restart the whole 
game from where we were to level six. You can view your chat when you're offline. Doubt they'll notice in time though. Yeah, yeah, it, uh, your chat stays open even if you're not live. Um, uh, but you'd have to also be in that window to see it and it, it does clear out. Or maybe, I don't know, maybe it what does. Maybe it doesn't. But I've definitely gone to my own chat when I was offline to like test new emotes or chat commands or whatever. You guys, are we still playing Night in the Woods? <laughs> I should change my game, t game title. I'm not ready for the shooting enemies. Like... Gansy, thank you so much for that follow. I appreciate it. This mini game is a better indie game than like six I've played in the last two years. What a burn. <laughs> but also, yeah, not. This is fun. This is actually fun. Um, I didn't expect very much when uh, when they were like, "Oh, there's a mini game in, inside this game." Oh, I should have known they were gonna do that. Oh god. Oh. At least they give health. Yeah, I don't know. I've recently... So I play mostly indie games on my channel. By the way, I'm Ray. <laughs> for, for new people coming in. Um, I mostly play indie games. Sometimes I'll play some AAA games if they pique my interest, but mostly indies. And um, recently, I think there's been so many studios rushing to get stuff out that a lot of the games I've been playing have felt kind of lackluster or incomplete. Um, just, but it could also just be unlucky about some of the ones that I picked. This looks like a final boss. Harvey, now is not the time, bud. All right, he has some range. All right, two hits is greedy. Ooh, God. No! Damn it, damn it. I wasn't, I was too rushed, too rushed. Okay. attack it looks like the enemies are randomized which is kind of cool ah, 
too late. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Let me out. All right. Because those were all of the shield guys last time. Didn't even need that health. Aw, oh, Harvey, it's gonna be okay, bud. Give me just a minute, okay? Oh, fuck! I got stuck. I'll let you out. Just a minute, buddy. I know you guys can't hear him, but he's just crying in the corner of the room. Alright, alright. I got you, buddy. Is, um... Is anyone playing the Outer Wilds DLC? I haven't picked it up yet. So no no spoilers, but I am very excited to play it. Um, my partner has started playing it and is planning to play a little bit more tonight. Um, and I, I'm like so sad that I can't watch because I don't want to spoil for my own playthrough. Also, this music is groovy. <laughs> there we go. All right, to the boss. You'll watch when I stream it like the main game? Hell yeah. Oh, fuck. Good enough, I guess. Cyan, you're gonna get going? Well, thanks so much for hanging out and chatting. Glad to have you here. Have a good night. All right, diagonals are awesome. here king cat king skeleton cat yeah oh more of them okay did it best ggs hell yeah level five New music, too. Ooh. Getting the extra dashes is nice. started. We just have so much maneuverability that I'm like, why even hang out anywhere? Why fight anything? Ugh. Ow, ow, god, I didn't see that you still had a body. There we go. They're being generous with the health drops. Okay, not with the enemy spawns, though. Good grief. Get out of here. I 
Any of these have health in them? Got him. Perfect. That's what you love to see. Oh, I'm so bad. Jeez, uh, that hurt. Well, at least there's a little more health around here before we do the boss. What? I thought I had another attack. Okay. Oh, jeez. I doubt he's gonna drop another health, so why even bother? Let's go. Uh, no, I, I want full health going into the boss. Hell yeah. All right, now we can go. All right. Whoa, okay. This is gonna explode into a bunch of little ones. It does two damage too. I think the king cat did too, but I, I didn't pay close enough attention to confirm. All right, I played Isaac. I know that we want to take down one of these at a time. So we don't get overrun. Isaac has prepared me. Ooh. First damage. Or I guess second damage on the boss. nice of them to give a little bit of health there. Ha! Did it! Heck yeah, what time is it? 9.30? Okay. I can go a little longer. Level 6. The church. How many levels are there? We are running out of health. Like, there's... You start with one less health every level. All right, it's gotta be on the other side. Rough, okay. They get damaged by their own fire. That's cool. What? Oh god. Uh, that's it. That's it. I wonder if we'll get to come back to this. Because I feel like I've had my fill at this point. It's 
surrender. But surrender to the horror sounds like quit. You're not coming back. Let's do one more time. One more time. We know where the uh, he is. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Okay, this wasn't the run. This wasn't it. Okay, it's not too late. Just stay away from the fire. The fire is the most dangerous. so bad why am i so bad all right one more try because i'm stubborn We can just go straight to the boss fight and see how we do. Let's see what this one's like. I guess we have to get these guys first. We can remember that there's a health. Oh, we're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. We're gonna be fine. Guys, oh, those guys are just invincible. Ooh. This guy's rough. No wonder the key was so close to the boss, because they're like, we know you're going to have to do this one a couple times. Damn it. I wasn't that far. I, I wasn't that far. I, I could get this. I could do this. I can do this. I just hate these fire guys. Rude. if more guys are going to spawn in there or not. Alright, we're in good shape. We're doing okay. Key. Excellent. Is there another health in here to be aware of? Nope. Okay. Ah, God. Those guys are the hardest. They're just so fast. Okay, okay, okay. Heck yeah. 
Let's go ahead preemptively break a couple of these. Oh, I didn't go through him. The fire is harder to dodge through. I'm not sure if you can. In fact, I don't, well, you if you hit it, it just pops. Another random health drops. Oh no! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Fuck! Shit! Shit! I was doing okay. I actually got some like decent hits in. It's fine. It's fine. Why can't I adapt? I couldn't attack. I was going too fast. I was going too fast. I'm slipping. I'm slipping. I had confidence. And it was... I was overly confident. Hey! They killed each other. Love to see it. That was nice that they were like, oh, you hate the fire guys? We'll make them kill each other and then we won't spawn them in the only room you need to go to. It's fine. guys get them out of the way before these guys start charging us ooh getting them one at a time that's helpful if you don't blow it come at me yeah What is this? Fourth time's the charm? We got it. We got this. Um, this helped a lot. Having those broken in advance was big help. Oh, I shouldn't have taken that, though. Oh, it spawned another one. Well, now we need it. That was bad damage, bad damage. Fuck, that was worse damage. Landed on top of him. Man, this is hard.
One more. One more hit. There I was able to dash through the fire and it didn't hurt me. Yes! 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 Heck yes. That was satisfying. Blood moat. Oh my god, we only have four permanent health. Oh, this is gonna be hard. This is gonna be really hard. All right, we're getting a feel for it. It's okay. I like when they hit each other. All right, so we know we got a couple of health there. Bunch of health, actually. All right, so there's the boss. There is the key. Key room. I've been lurking for a while. This game took a shift, huh? Yeah, it did. So we're playing a mini game on our character on May's computer and uh, it's actually really fun. I've been playing it for at least a half hour. Probably longer than that actually. And I thought that I was just gonna like play a level or two but now we've done like six levels and I'm just really enjoying it. Getting hard though. Fuck. Like we we started with the um, nine permanent health, and now we're down. Every time we complete a level, we lose a permanent health and gain a dash, and so now we only have four left. It's like Zelda meets Crypt of the Necrodancer or something. Yeah, the first um. The first comparison I made was um, uh, 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 Hyperlight Drifter. All right, don't love the fire boss. Okay, we can dash through fire, confirmed. This guy's not that hard, though. I bet we can't touch the moat. I bet that's what makes it hard in a minute. So we have to kind of... Fuck, fuck, fuck! No! 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 We were so close! We had one more! God! Ah! Damn it! Damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it! Damn it! Bullshit! Fucking shit, dicks. Fuck. I'm ready never to say that during boss fights. I jinxed myself, you're right. Oh wow, they can all just come in here, huh? Get out. Get out of here. Fuck off. Get the fuck out. Get out of my get out of my room. Ugh.
Give me the key. Got it. Little, literally ensured my own defeat. You're right. This isn't that hard. Triggers phase three. <laughs> Losing health but gaining dashes is a cool mechanic. I wish mini game. Um, wish this mini game was the whole game a little bit. This could have been built out to be an entire game. I, I feel confident that they could have done that if they wanted to. Yeah. I mean, I guess I don't know how long it was, but like I would play it if they like polish this even just like a tiny tiny bit like it, it feels really fun but the the dashing just feels a little bit off um where like if i want to dash across here across this lake right i have to do it from here i can't do it from here if i do it from here uh i'll hurt myself so that just feels a little weird damn it These guys were not here last time. Well, this was a disaster. All right, that was a that was a disaster. Enter the dungeon felt like that. Hmm. You know what? Speaking of dungeon crawlers, has anyone played Legend of Grimrock? Either one or two. Either one of them. Because Legend of Grimrock is a game that I want to go back to, and I've thought about streaming it. Um, because Legend of Grimrock, I think, is a kind of a gem of dungeon diving games. Um, it's really cool. And I, like, I had never played a game like that. It's like, it almost feels turn-based, but it's not. I don't know what you call that. Damn it. All right, that was me being sloppy. That was sloppy. Yes, Bridge, you've played it. It's such a unique game. Yeah, it's so cool. And Legend of Grimrock 2 was one of those like rare examples where they took a game that had a good concept and they just made it better. Quasi? Quasi turn-based? I actually don't know that term. Who are these guys? These guys are new. <gasps> they have projectiles. Fuck, I knew this day was coming. No, I hate them. I hate them. Damn it. Fuck, get, no, get lost, get wrecked. I hate these. No. Oh, they suck. Those guys suck. What the fuck? Quasi. Oh, okay, okay. Might and Magic, super old school, Insurrected. Mm. Oh. All right. Oh, come on. I'm starting to wonder if these levels are kind of randomly generated. Like, I, I know that the enemies are, but it seems like some of the other features of the levels are too. Like, I don't remember it being set up like this to get up to the, the boss area. Like, this part feels the same, but that top area seems different. Seemingly, apparently, but not really got it. Thank you. Appreciate it. My vocab. Oh, what? I thought you were dead. This is hard. No, no. Oh, God. All right. It is randomly generated. These levels are randomly generated. After playing for like 40 minutes, I have confirmed it's randomly generated.
Part of me is like, if the area spawns with those projectile guys, I should just like, I should just suicide and res respawn the level because they're just so shitty. Oh my God, what? <laughs> maybe I just, maybe I just suck at this a little bit. I bet there's 10 levels and you have to do the last level with only one health, which I, I don't know about that one. Like, I'm struggling. I wish I could reach him. Oh god. Oh god! When you get hit, you get stunned and you can't dash or move at all. I don't know how I got to the boss on my first try at this level. Oh, rude. Oh my god, what? What? <laughs> what just happened? I need to clean up dashing for sure. Yeah, the dashing is is just clunky. But like other than that, I really don't have any complaints about this little mini game. Like I mean, it's a mini game, right? Like you don't expect it to be polished, so it's already just like better than I ever expected. Uh also I feel like the game just handed it to me here, um, compared to, like, as long as this fire guy doesn't see me. Okay. Um, compared to those earlier levels, which were just way harder. So hopefully from here I can get to the boss, because I didn't look up yet. Those guys are still gonna be a nightmare. Let's get rid of you. Might as well get rid of you too. Oh god. All right. There was health uh, here and below. We'll go grab it. Get this one. Come at me. Come get me through spikes. <sighs> this is gonna be tough. I don't even think I've hit them yet. That's what's scary.
Yeah, projectile would be so nice right here. Everyone saw that, right? Every I I that that was pro. Yeah. <laughs> okay. All right, we're still in this. We got this. We've got full health going into boss number six. This guy. We know what to expect. Come at me. That one hurt my feelings, I'm not going to lie. What are you seeing, Ray? Uh, Orc, this is a mini game inside of uh, Night in the Woods. Look at his smug face. Oh, that was like our best chance, too. That was like the best setup for it. This doesn't look too bad. Oh, nope, never mind. This is terrible. was gonna happen <laughs> nine thank you for the clip do fire oh I'm so screwed damn all right you gotta hit the hay loof you know I was just about to say the same thing I actually do have to go it's getting late here uh, it's 10 o'clock so I think I am going to send off a raid, but I will say, um, before you go, Luth, if you stick around for the raid, you'll get channel points, which you can use to make me play getting over it. So there is that. Um, but thank you all for hanging out. PRG, thanks again for that raid. If you are hanging out in my chat and you haven't checked out PRG, definitely drop over and give a follow. Uh, Orc, Bridge, Nine, Jam, Loof. Thank you all for hanging out. We had some new follows today. Cyan and Grey Gansey. Thank you for those follows. <laughs> More than enough to do that. Fair enough. <laughs> Good to know. I don't know how many channel points people have in my channel. So, like, I've been thinking about lowering the point redeems for some stuff because... 
I was like, eh, I don't know, maybe it's too expensive. Like, maybe it takes too long, but maybe that's not true. <laughs> maybe I shouldn't. Okay, let's see who's online. Um, we'll set up a raid. Let me check. Looks like Peachy Panda is playing some Alien Isolation. Love watching a good spooky game. Yeah. Yeah, Orc, your uh, your playthrough of Alien Isolation has confirmed to me that it is not a game that I would enjoy. <laughs> but I like watching it. <laughs> Imagine streaming Alien. Yeah, um, I will say, before I send you guys over, one of the games that I am considering playing for the last week of October is Soma, because I think that's the scariest game I could handle and still maybe enjoy. So uh, look forward to that. Um, Otherwise, I've got a couple other games that I'm kind of like debating around for the rest of the month. I know this game is relatively short, depending on how long I spend working on this mini game, but we'll see. Um, but all right, I'm gonna send you guys over. Have a great night. I will catch you next time, probably on Tuesday, either tomorrow or Tuesday.